Time for Health Check tonight. A new survey is revealing a lot of oversized waistlines in the five county Philadelphia area. Health report and registered nurse Ali Gorman is at the Action's Big Board with the numbers and what it could all mean. Ali. Hey guys, yeah, and this is disheartening news. Some reports say the obesity epidemic is leveling off nationally, but that's not the case locally. A phone survey that's done every year with 10,000 families shows that nearly 63% of adults in our area are either overweight or obese. As for kids, nearly one in five is obese, and that is higher than the national average. Now, we know that diet is a problem. It's not easy, but everyone should try to eat five to seven servings of fruits and vegetables every day. Half of the people surveyed don't even eat three of those servings a day. And four out of 10 kids drink a sugary soft drink at least once a day. Of course, all of this can lead to other problems. Now, the survey also found that in Philadelphia, 37% of adults have high blood pressure, 16% have diabetes. That can put you at risk for heart disease and for stroke. But the good news is it's been proven if you make small changes, just one or two things, becoming more active, cutting down on fast food, you will see results. And speaking of seeing results, how would you like to get paid to lose weight? We have an update on a local woman who did just that. Courtney Heichel joined the six month healthy wage weight loss challenge this winter. She bet $150 that she could lose 10% of her body weight. If she failed, she would lose the money. But if she succeeded, the company would double her money. Well, Courtney is now down 14 pounds and her wallet is $300 heavier. It's just like little changes that over a long period of time sticking with that paid off. Now those changes included eating healthier foods and sticking to an exercise plan. She says the wager helped and she is not alone. Studies show that betting on weight loss increases the odds for success. And that, of course, is just one way to do it. There are tons of programs and books out there to help. And we have more information on the program that Courtney did and other programs on 6abc.com. Good Monica. for her. Isn't that great? I Thank know. you, Allie.